This is a LexisNexis video tutorial. Introduction to Library Express. The first thing you should do with LexisNexis Library Express is to check out the main easy search form. Take a look around at the different widgets available, like the Search the News widget. Simply type in a search term select a group file, or you can type in a specific publication, like the New York Times. This will bring back a broad range of news articles about Obama from the New York Times. You can also quickly look up a legal case by citation, party names, or topic. In addition to that, you can quickly retrieve a company dossier snapshot by entering the name of a company or a ticker symbol. If you need help with any of these three widgets, click on the orange help icon to be taken to our product wiki. It's important to know that you can always come back to the easy search form by clicking the home link or the LexisNexis Library Express logo. Besides the search widgets, you'll also notice the blue navigation menu. There's a lot of content on Library Express, and there are about two dozen forms to help you with the research you're doing. You can find these forms using the navigation menu. Now we're at the easy search form. Click on the different sections to expand the section. For example, I'll click on news to see all the news forms available. The active search form is always highlighted in the navigation menu. The All News form is a good example of the basic design of search forms in Library Express. So let's click on All News. As you can see, All News is now highlighted in blue, and the arrow indicates this is the current form being displayed. At the top are three rows of boxes you can fill in, then a date selector, then a source selector. A lot of search forms also have tools related to the content they search. In this case, we're searching the news, so down at the bottom, there's a tool that lets you pick out the most popular types of news articles, the Limit To section. You'll also see links to our help. The help is on our research guide wiki. There are articles for every search form and every specific location on the search form. So if you were to click here, you will see help for the Select Source section of the All News Search Form. Let's take a look. There's also a tip section on most search forms. Here you can find advice and tools that will make your life easier. Almost all tips will include an Edit and Power Search link that will take any search that you've built on these forms and translate them to the Power Search Form. There, you can construct a more sophisticated search. Let's try a search on the All News form. I want to search for news about Canada from last month in The Economist. So I'll type in Canada, select the previous month, and type in The Economist. Let's search. Here you can see the results list. The results list is in list format, and every time you run a search in LexisNexis Library Express, the results will come back looking like this. Unless you happen to run a search that only brings back one hit, in that case you'll be taken to the actual document. Take a look around your screen to see your options. On the left, we have sorting options and display options. On the right, we have buttons to edit search, start a new search, or search within results. You can also print this list of results, email the list of results, save to disk, or if you have a RefWorks account, you can export your citations. On the left, you'll see clustering features that we won't discuss now, but that you should look for. These are very useful for large result sets. See an article by clicking on its link. 
This will take you to a full text view. Use the buttons at the top to go to the next or previous document. If you want to go back to your results set, click the drop down box at the top left and go back to list. Now that you're comfortable with the forms and the results list view, let's talk about selected sources. Let's click on the logo to go back to the Easy Search form. Click on the Sources section to go to the Source Directory options. Here you see we can either browse for sources or find a particular source. Let's try Browse. As you can see, the Browse Sources form uses a folder display. The sources are classified by publication type. You can also sort them by news and business topics, industry, or area of law. The Browse Sources form also allows you to filter by region of publication. Now let's click on the Find Sources form. Here you can type a publication name or a topic and find sources. To add this publication to your search, simply select it. As soon as you select the source, it pops up in the sources tray. Whenever you see the eye icon, you can click on it to get more information about the source. It appears this way throughout the interface. After you click OK Continue, you'll see that the source now appears on the Power Search form. For more information about the Power Search form, check back to our YouTube channel for more videos.